you've been wanting an easy way to filter the water going to your kitchen sink, wet bar, or bathroom, this video is for you. This is super easy installation. It's just in and out. It's two hoses. Disconnect your cold water supply. It's going to be on the right-hand side when you get underneath the sink. Use a wrench to get it started, then undo it by hand. Then take the same connection that comes from the packaging in this and screw it in. This is going to be the hose that goes into the filter. It comes with a sticker template. Stick it where you want the filter, put two screws in the wall. You could pre-drill them with a drill bit if you need to. If you go too deep and you have adjacent closets, you might punch through the other side. Just beware of that. Then you can take your second hose that leads up to the faucet uh, and just screw it in. Snug it up with a couple wrenches. You don't need to go too tight on these things. they got gaskets. And then basically, you just plug these things into the sides of the filter. It's super easy. You can't really mess it up. Uh, go ahead and turn your water back on and you want to check for leaks and run the fixture for five minutes to prime the filter. It's going to help get the carbon taste out of the water because that's basically what these filters are. I'm going to do a separate video on how to clean the aerator if you need that. I always like to either write on the filter or put a sticker of the date when I replace it. This one's going to last about 12 months. When it starts to get full of debris, the water pressure will slow down. That's when you know you need to replace it. This is so simple to replace, just in and out.